social media friendly. Not First camera, ni camera friendly at all. Not camera friendly. <laughs> ni pa hablar. Nada. Like, cero lero. <clears throat> We're like at zero. Mm -hmm. But I remember when that co-worker told us, it was just like, hmm, huh, why not? And we weren't scared. No. <laughs> no, we were very motivated. Es que así empezamos. <laughs> of putting yourself out there mm -hmm. to be criticized by everyone when everyone has an opinion mm -hmm. to say and they, like you're gonna like after this like if you do this like you can do anything. Yeah. Because yeah, no, sometimes the fear it's not what other people tell you the fear is in your head. Mm. Hola molcas. Welcome back to Compartiendo. Mi tote with Lupita and Adilane. Hello everyone, welcome back to our episode number 41. Uh, bravo, bravo. <laughs> <laughs> ya me yeah. llegamos a 50. Yes. And <laughs> we want to thank you guys for the support that you guys have been giving us in the past video. Like it, it was really amazing. You guys made our days. Oh yeah, you guys should have seen. And we noticed like I was telling Lupita like the two days it was like at 40 something and then we checked it again it was like 80 and then we got to 104 I think was the highest. Which is pretty good because if you guys follow us, I think we got like 100 and something in the first video which was the one that most people watched it mm -hmm. um, than all the rest. So ahí vamos, ahí vamos, digo Lupita, es que estos son los te temas que yo creo maybe you guys can relate with us or maybe you're going through it. Or son temas que nos caen. <laughs> yeah, because on that video that was episode 39, and on that one we uh, talked about how do you know what you're going to do with your life. The rest like, of your life, yeah. The rest what of career? Your life. Like what career. And uh, maybe that's something that you guys could relate to us. Mm -hmm. But it was really amazing to see the support. Yes, guys. Thank you, thank you. And keep sharing, keep liking, and comment. Yes, we want to hear you guys. Don't forget about us. Yes, <laughs> we definitely. appreciate you. And for this one, we brought another topic. Another juicy one, and I think you guys can relate on this one too. <laughs> <laughs> you want to say it? Let me tell me. <laughs> you can go ahead. So, we want to talk about el miedo, like the fear. Like, why is it that? Well, let me tell you guys how we got to this tema because I think it's kind of interesting to tell you guys. Well, I was watching a podcast. You guys have probably maybe seen it, Alanized. And they were talking about how sometimes fear nos detiene en muchas cosas, en miedo. Y yo creo, pues a todos nos ha pasado, ¿verdad? Pero estaban hablando en sí como de abrir un negocio. O de que nuestros papás vienen de México y tienen miedo de invertir tanto dinero. Y que... O sea, no sepas qué vaya a pasar con ese dinero. Like, esa... Like, ambiguity. Like, de no saber. Um, and I, I told Lupita, I was like, Lupita, I go, this is a good tema. We should probably talk about it. Because I feel like a lot of people can maybe relate to this. I don't know if you guys are scared of doing something out of the bloom or out of, o sea, the norm. Or what you think is normal. But that but actually, think. like, now that you were saying it's true. Because, for example, like, I feel like are like our parents were really brave right mm -hmm. like they like my parents are from mexico they were really brave they came here to the united states they didn't know uh, much like they didn't know the language they were not familiar with the city it was way different they were from a small town to now a city it was a big shocker but i feel they were thought um no you go you work mm -hmm. and you put money away Mm -hmm. Oh no, you work, you put money away. You yes, work, sir. you put money away. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, but for example, they would say, like my, I remember my father would tell me, if you ever want to buy something, mm -hmm. don't waste your money on cars. Waste your money on land. Mm -hmm. He always told me, like, buy land. Mm -hmm. Land will always go up the price. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter what happens. Appreciate that. Yeah. And... I was like, well, yeah, that's true. But I feel like they were like, yeah, I'll buy land, but mm -hmm. in my own little town, mm -hmm. like where I know, like yeah. where I know the people. I'm not going to come and buy land here in the United States because I don't know no one. What if they, like, me as in fraud, you know, or take my money, or I get a fraud, or I get still scammed. Sold. Yes, scammed. I was like, that's what I think. But for example, as the time passes mm -hmm. and, um, you know, you get to know more people and everything. I feel that 
sometimes they can break their fear but sometimes it's just like no i wasn't that bad and i don't trust because i feel anyway. that as hispanics um like my parents like with money like they don't really mm -hmm. like trust no you know what now that you mentioned it like my mom not so long ago i'm gonna share something that happened to her <laughs> i didn't even ask but it's nothing bad <laughs> Um, so she wanted to do like this weekend and like do carne like um, en chile rojo, quería hacer frijoles de arroz y lo hizo, ¿verdad? Todo. Super. Sí, para vender. Y pues le invirtió un buen. Me acuerdo que fuimos al Sam's a comprar los vasos y she was like, ¡Ah! That's so expensive. I'm like, Mom, inviértele. Like, no seas coda, le digo, inviértele. Pues así es un negocio, le digo, así, like. No sé por qué tienen tanto miedo. ¿Será que porque pues, no, pues batalla, obvio? Mm -hmm. You struggle to get your money, so you're probably like scared of spending it and maybe not being what you thought it was gonna be. Mm -hmm. So, bueno, she bought these cups and then the lids come separately. And she's like, darn it, now I have to buy the lids and they're expensive too. I go, ma'am, again, I'm sorry, inviertele, es un negocio, un negocio. You have to invertirle, aunque. No quieras, aunque se te haga caro. In my perspective, well, I think that's just how business runs. So, she bought that too. And then, um, she spent all night, because she started doing, all, she got this thought, like, in la tarde. So, she started doing, the, like, all of the food, and um, she was still, era la noche, y todavía estaban chinga haciendo la comida. Wow. <laughs> she left that thing on, because, of course, she was going to go sleep, so she was going to sell it the next morning, like, for lunchtime. So people can buy their lunch from her. And she had already had like all kinds of uh, orders in. Like she was telling everyone we knew. She was posting it on Facebook and everything. Everything was good. Like parecía que se le iba a vender todo y it was good. Well, since she left it on, it went bad. She had to throw it. So she had to tell all those people. Because some of those people actually came to get the, the food. And they tasted it. And they're like, not, like, not to be mean. Le dijo, like this lady was her cousin. She's like, but I think. That el chile está malo. And I was like, no, no, like, it should be good. Like, no. In the morning, she and my auntie had already ate a burrito. Mm -hmm. So she's like, no, it was like good. It was fine. It wasn't bad. She's like, and then she smelled it. And then she's like, you know what? Yeah, se me shot perder. Mm -hmm. So she had to throw all of the food she had made. She felt so disappointed. She had to give money back to the people who bought it. A uno les tuvo que quedar mal y decir, I'm sorry, but I can't sell you this. It's, it's gone bad like there's nothing i can do and um people understood but she was so disappointed like because it co le costó tanto like el poder el invertir porque es que fuimos mm. and she was like i know it's too expensive el sacrificio, el sacrificio. Las cosas, like, sí, the sacrifice so, you do like you for example like let's be honest like we live mainly pay paycheck to paycheck mm -hmm. like we don't get paid that much like mm -hmm. let's be honest like this is like <clears throat> reality meanwhile um like you're putting some money like to save some money and you're like for example you have 500 600 dollars and you want to do that so mm -hmm. you go and spend it mm -hmm. and that happens so mm -hmm. like all the money like goes down the drain mm -hmm. and now like you're left with no, nothing nothing even worse than como empezaste because mm -hmm. at least you had to save verdad yeah yeah no pero le digo a mi mamá es que that's the that's the That's what business is. Like, no siempre te va a salir bien, no, la primera. Y le, I wouldn't even push her. I was like, mom, like, it's the first time. Le digo, look all the people you got to, like, buy from you. You can do this. Le digo, because she even helped me with, like, my clothes when I first started. Like, she was the one that actually sold. I, I suck at selling. <laughs> she was the one that was sold. Le digo, mom, you can do this. Le digo, like, try it again. No te des por vencida. Es más, hace poquito le dije, ma, ¿por qué no vuelves a vender? And she's, like, thinking about it now again. But she's kind of scared because she already, that already happened to her. She, so she doesn't want to risk it again. But le digo, es que business is a risk. But you take maybe, that risk. like, instead of cooking during the night... The morning. Before, go to sleep, mm -hmm. dijo, and wake up cocine. early in the morning, and mm -hmm. then you can put the things to cook, and mm -hmm. then you can mm -hmm. put everything to que to se le va, o sea, like que se enfríe. It's for temperature. Yeah, and then you can put it away, because once mm -hmm. it hits certain temperature, it's safe for you to put it in the fridge, but it has to be at that temperature. And then you can sell it. Yeah, pues ya aprendió su lección, pero que no hablé, pues ya, but now she's scared. Yeah, because that happened. That happened. But I think that's how just business is. And I think, do you think it's also because where they come from or what they were taught or why are they like no, that? No, I like, well, yeah, how they were taught, but like they don't know, like 
they don't know they're like it's hard to trust Adelian. let's be honest like if you have eight, yo soy bien bruta yo si no I trust too much creo yo soy los que fácil me pueden scam se me hace if you have eight hundred dollars saved for example like and you're like oh okay like so today i'm gonna put a juicing uh business <laughs> right mm -hmm. oh and there basically compras all your vegetables you come you use them and everything mm -hmm. and then it comes to the other side of the business like promoting if you didn't promote enough you're not gonna get that many sales mm -hmm. if you didn't give it people to taste it you're Menos. not gonna get that many mm -hmm. sales so you're like oh or sometimes to could be like oh no like that's a lot of work you know what you reminded me of like just what you said i don't know if you guys have seen this lady she's on tiktok <coughs> she made like her own like little stand outside the house and she sells coffee and at first she was getting it free yes but she has now she has her customers but in her house like outside her house she has yeah. a little stand ahí tiene toda la máquina para lo del café y le va rete bien i'm like that's awesome like well because like you have to like if you want to start a business for example you have to be invested you have to invest but you have to be conscious that you're going to take a risk there mm -hmm. might be mm -hmm. good days there might be bad days yep. there might be problems and there's going to be solutions mm -hmm. but it's hard when you live paycheck to paycheck because if i put those 800 to waste and it's barely it's used three weeks and i'm not going to be able to make them how am i going to pay my rent you yeah. know what i mean so i feel that sometimes that also like it's hard for you Stressful. to break your fear because you're like yeah i'm putting all this money mm -hmm. oh like on this because i want to do it but like if it goes wrong like how am i gonna pay right when mm -hmm. i do think that if you're gonna start a business you should never the like there should never be the possibility in your mind like what if it goes wrong mm -hmm. no like there should be option a i'm gonna do this option b i'm doing this option c i'm pushing <laughs> towards this option d i'm going this way mm -hmm. like you should have options for succeed like success mm -hmm. yeah like <clears throat> porque imagine like if you like open a business and this is pensando negativo you can attract negativity so what's gonna happen yeah that's true but you know what like i don't know but i see like gr girls on tiktok who have their own businesses and even like mandy for example mm -hmm. she said Simple like i should no siempre vendo a veces no tienen pues tienen malas rachas verdad como todo mundo así como mm -hmm. dices like one time you can be selling and tomorrow maybe you don't sell anything and it's something that you just have to keep doing and doing and doing and try to get more sales <laughs> that can be stressful like do you put your business like the vender ropa right yeah tengo que renovar mi licencia but like um los taxes <laughs> no, <yo no. laughs> i have like on the back of my hand like, ah, i need to do that but comenzaste con esa mm -hmm. it was a dreamy desire que tú querías mm -hmm. it's still there but i i feel like i need more money <laughs> Yeah, or like, is this the only experience that you've had, like selling, like something of your own? Well, on my own, yes. Yeah. Insurances, but nunca también eso no se me va. I used to, sabes que I used to sell antes cuando encargaban las sobrecamas por catálogo. I used to sell that. Yeah, that's actually how I paid my dad. Really? The first time, I paid it like with that. Yeah, I used to take care of, I know I used to take care of uh, some uh, girls too. And at the moment, the Atlantis, the princess house. Damn. <laughs> you know what you reminded me? Like, I was uh, talking about that in that podcast, like, or in one that I saw on TikTok, uh, where they said, Do you remember when they were selling the mamas that home interior, that home interior, that um, the ollas prestige, that princess house? que Avon, Mary Kay, hay muchas marcas que que vendían, se encargaban por catálogo, yeah, like how was that experience? How did you start? Like how was it? Were you scared? Well, no, because I remember like I had taken care of a little girl for like 
one week or two and she was gonna go to school mm -hmm. so i was like oh like i'm only gonna have like a hundred dollars i was like oh what am i gonna do with a hundred dollars nothing <laughs> so i was like oh then i was like thinking to myself i was like oh i'm gonna call her so i'm gonna ask so i could like sell <laughs> like las colchas or whatever mm -hmm. And yeah, they sent me all my things and I sent my money <laughs> and yeah, I got it. And I was like, okay, so now what do I have? Option A, option A, option A, there's <laughs> nothing else. <laughs> like here's what you got. So you're going to go, you're going to ask, you're going to talk with people, you're going to tell them, la la. They're going to tell you no, but it's okay. The next one will tell you yes. Mm -hmm. And I would like, I, all my time, like it was like that. Like I would go like sometimes with my friends and everything. And I remember one of my friends, because she was from middle school, she's like, yeah, like in this case, you didn't sell nothing because she didn't buy me nothing, but at least we talked. I was like, yeah. <laughs> Do you think that's where you got that from? Like, you're not scared of talking. Like, you talk to anyone no matter what. I think that well, was a little... have I you know, always just I've always been like that, like real talkative. But I was like, no, like, I'm, I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it. And I was saving money because I wanted to apply for a doc. I was mm -hmm. like, oh, no. Like, I you didn't give up? Like, I'm not going to give up. Like, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. And yeah, I did. And then I applied for a doc. And then that's when I got a, a job. But when I, even when I had my job, but like, I was still selling. Damn. Princess house and everything that I could. I was like, yeah, I want to try it. I want to <laughs> <I wanna>, see. Because <laughs> it wouldn't matter, like, if it didn't go as well as I mm. thought. But I, I was going to learn, mm -hmm. you know? You experienced mm -hmm. it for, like, yeah. Yeah, if I was going to lose my $100, well, um, I was going to lose my $100. I would have lost them in the store as well. So I was like, Might okay. as well. Might as well. Yeah. Which, that's another thing. I feel like we <clears> spend <throat> money on stupid stuff that really doesn't benefit us at all. And otras cosas que, like, si nos puede beneficiar. We're like, ah! <laughs> es que no. sometimes, like... It's hard, like, when you go to the you want things and everything, and, like, you know. You're like, yeah. I work so hard. Me lo merezco. That's yeah. what I always say. Oh, I don't want to pay. And then, like, ah! No, that was not a financial, ¿cómo se dice? A smart idea to do. No. Yeah, like, that's, o sea, it's because it's <laughs> hard. <laughs> like, sometimes, like, it's hard. Sí. Like, to tell your own self, no. Because sometimes you're like, oh my God, like, trabajo todo el mes. Todo el año. Like, yeah, I can't believe I still have no money and all these things, you know. Mm -hmm. You're like, ah, un poquito más tanto. Yeah. But, what else about fear? I don't know, like, like hemos dicho esto también antes. Fear, like, kind of, like, te detiene, pero tenemos que quitarnos esa palabra de encima y no tener miedo a nada. Nada pierdes, como dices tú. Me acordaste también cuando he escuchado que dicen, es que no tengan miedo. Lo más que te van a decir es no, y no te va a matar, no te va a hacer nada. Nomás, ok, next. Uh -huh. <ríe> como dices tú, uh -huh. se me vino también a la mente, porque también hay un señor que da consejos para vender. No me acuerdo cómo se llama, Alex, pero no me acuerdo el apellido. Y él, nunca se me va a olvidar porque se me quedó hasta bien grabado. Yo creo hasta el hecho en el otro parque es cuando tuvimos a la muchacha que vende um, oh, zapatos. Just... Sí. Yeah. Dices es que no se dice quiere comprarlo, no, ¿cómo es? Quiere comprar, no, ¿le gusta o no? ¿Se lo va a llevar o no? Sí, se lo va a llevar o no, like, es que el vocabulario, like, you see, if you notice people who know how to sell, tienen labia, like, they know how to talk to people. Mm -hmm. And that's something that I think you need to do, do or practice or But evolve. Like, you have to have a good vocabulary with a business in regards to your customers mm -hmm. to uh, like el proveedor mm -hmm. the one that provides the for merchant. you like the yeah like the factory or whatever like you have to have a good vocabulary because how are you going to get a good business deal. out there a good deal to come and do something else you need to know how, how to negotiate because mm -hmm. maybe porque el hijo Lupita like en veces me pongo a pensar like me and myself like in just my like thoughts y digo si uno en verdad quiere algo uno lo puede hacer porque me he puesto a like pensar en veces digo bueno con el parque es, si en verdad nos quisiéramos poner y podríamos bueno tan y tan más followers right pero si en verdad quisiéramos podríamos ir a todas las tienditas del volcán que decirle oiga la puedo promover y le corro tanto like anything I've seen these people on TikTok who make a business out of nothing Like nothing, literally. Like for example, there's one that recoge basuras de las casas. I'm like, that's awesome. Like, and I feel like that's something that, like we, like me and my mom, we don't have a truck and we don't have anyone that has a truck. So we're like, 
cómo tiramos la basura, si no tenemos troca ni traerla, nada. So, I would totally, well, you have to have the money to pay for this, right? But still, I think <coughs> people will find out, o sea, juntan el dinero para que alguien venga y lo recoja. Um, otro señor, es que hay tantas ideas que I'm like, damn, no saca a la gente de que quiere, puede. No, <laughs> where there's a problem, there's a business. This one washes trash cans. Five dollars. Dice que empezó, like, go knocking on the neighbors and be like, can I wash your thumbs, your trash cans? And it's five dollars each. Y se fue por todo el... Le dijeron que sí, ¿verdad? Y le siguió todo el neighborhood. Y luego después de todo el neighborhood, other neighborhoods. And he makes, like, five thousand dollars a month. I'm like, how? You actually reminded me when I was 11 years old and I used to live in this mobile home park. <coughs> and I would get out from school and... Like in my house, my dad was a really alcoholic, so we didn't have much money. Mm -hmm. So we wouldn't have like much groceries. And mm -hmm. I was like, oh, I'm gonna go tell them my neighbors because they were like older people. I was like, oh, I'm gonna go tell them if I could clean their yards. And yet, surely enough, like I like I ended up with a good clientele. Like I had like my clients Damn, already. <laughs> and I would go after school and go clean their yards on Saturdays and everything. And then, then we could go buy some groceries. Damn, es que el que uh -huh. quiere puede. Yo me pongo a pensar y digo, no me iré a mejorar ese tipo de trabajo en vez de otro trabajo de carrera porque hay que flojar otra vez. No, ya. Like, que que la otra estábamos diciendo, like, going back to school, pero I'm kind of like dreading now. I'm like, oh, do I really want to come back to school? I don't want to come back to school. <coughs> Be all stressed, reading. I hate reading. <coughs> but, like, neta, sometimes hasta me van a de irme hasta de, like, la construcción que me hace, like, anything. I'm so desperate, anything. Oh, I just kidding. feel that there's, like, como entonces. Como there is a, a business for and everything, like you have extra time, for example, Saturdays and Sundays. Mm -hmm. You, you like to cook. Pues, te digo algo, últimamente sí siento que sí me gusta algo así, no cierto de ti. I remember when <laughs> there was a point Pero in no your mucho, life that you were not cooking, gente, no. and you were like, oh no, like I miss that. <laughs> Like, there's things that you could do even if it's like selling cupcakes. No se me inflan. Eso sí salen. ¡Pum! ¿Sabes qué? Le he pensado. Like, postres. Estaba viendo una muchacha que era una gelatina. You like this so much. Cada vez, every single time, I remember when I was working with you in the clinic. ¡Mira este postre! ¡Mira esto! Es que soy bien antojada. Mira, pero it was always postres. Like, always it was desserts. And you know what? Now that you say that. Why don't you make desserts? And then on Saturdays, mm -hmm. you sell them. That's then true. you'll get extra money. You're right. And yeah. I know who I can start with because she has a lot of parties all the time. But, I, um, and you know what, too? When we <gasps> or those dessert tables are in there for the parties. Dessert mm -hmm. tables, you know, when they set up? Yeah. And you can, and you she can works make, like, a little two. menu and put, like, oh, like, I'm going to be this, making this, 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 and this dessert. Oh. It's going to be this much, this much for a dozen. Mm -hmm. And then make it. And then you start getting your orders, and then you have an extra job True. on the weekends. Because neta, I've been thinking about so many things. I'm like, Adriana, what can you do? What can you do? But you know what? It's kind of cool. Saben que me pongo también a pensar, like, antes yo tenía mucho miedo de empezar cualquier otra cosa y así. Y ahora, like, neta que no. Ahora sí me quiero aventar lo que sea. Si eso no me funciona, okay. Vámonos ahora a tratar otro negocio. Si eso tampoco otra, otro negocio. Así eso. I don't really, honestly, I do not want to be working for anyone else. I want to work in a business. Pero bueno, esa me viene otra. También voy a, voy a estar signing puro TikTok y puras influencers. <laughs> But, like, y Tati, she said que ella vendía, like, algo primero, no se le dio. Me dijo, bueno, vamos a cambiar. No hay negocio, pero ahora otra cosa. Y empezó con yeah. otra y así, hasta que le dio. I'm like, hmm. Smart. Like, it's true, like, bueno, tía, ¿qué has hecho tú? Nada. <laughs> Nomás el de la... <laughs> <risa> Nada más para todos estos tiktokers con sus negocios, no te creas tú. Estoy agarrando ideas. No, pues, nomás los de la ropa sí lo empecé. Es algo que todavía quiero. Like, no creas que no. Pero siento que necesito dinero tan siquiera para tener una tienda y tener más variedad. Porque siento que a la gente sí le gusta lo que traigo. Nomás que como precio ese vestido, viene muy reducido. Oh, y no hay dinero entra en el vestido. Por más flacas que estén, no entran. Es que no estira ni tantito. Hasta la he pensado, le digo, mamá. Contrataré a alguien para que me la agregue de alguna manera, para que estire y para que acá atrás nomás tenga el elastiquito. Pero no, no ruin it. And then, if I do that, no, le tengo que invertir más. Y ya le invertí en buen. <risa> Invertirlo otra vez más. Y lo si no sale como me gusta. Bueno, puedo intentarme vivir con uno. Just Pero es que a todo el mundo le gusta nomás que no les queda. <risa> like, why? Yeah. Yeah. 
But I still have not given that up. I do want to continue that, but right now I'm too broke for that. <laughs> but yeah. Y luego te digo, hasta neta, le he estado pensando, dije, si con los taxis me compro una troca, ¿qué es que estoy viejita? Y una traila para agarrar basura. Y hasta mi novio me dice, ¿estás loca? 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 <laughs> you know why you reminded of me in a bit of two? I don't know if you guys have seen this TikTok. Watch, let me see if I can put it. But it's about, um, like, the man that was like, uh, but I said the big bad word, but it's so funny. I don't know if I'm gonna find it. Um, like, it, it, like you for real? The man he needs to see. Like, I could see your boyfriend like looking at you and you're like, get by me, we're leaving tomorrow at five. <laughs> <laughs> you can help me. <laughs> no, pues sí. Voy a hacer un negocio que nos pague y nos saque a los dos de trabajar. A lot of things. Come on, come on. I'm gonna. Oh my God, you're funny. Let's see. 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 let us Oh, I clean the yards. Um, I work as a, a waitress on a restaurant. I went to clean houses when they That's like finished one. them, like just like uh, the constructing them. Yeah, I went yeah. to clean houses. Um, let me see, what else have I done? Mm. I found it. Yeah, I that. Sí, no es que tiene una mala palabrota, eh. No, I did. FYI. <coughs> Wait, hold on. <laughs> Have you heard it? It's funny. I always laugh because this is what man does. Like, <laughs> no, but I mean, it's. I still think it's good. to was trabajar, dijo. But anything, anything. Nunca tuviste miedo de irte a meter en osos de like a vender ese tipo de cosas. Con no, ninguno, no. no. ¿Conocías a alguien que lo hacía? No. How were you interested in it? How did you become interested in it? Pues, how did you I, know? Like, if I sold, I was, it was going to get me money. Like, because mm. I would call the places and look to them, like, oh, we work like this, this, and this, and then. Oh, you would call. you sell, like, it's going to give you this amount of money or whatever. I was like, oh, ah. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> I like it. I was like, okay, you're not doing nothing, so let's go. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, yeah, that's how I started, but lately ya no he hecho nada, fíjate. Ahora pensé que no está. Yo sí. Pero ya no en eso. Es que neta, guys, I don't know about you guys, but do you ever think about this kind of stuff? I don't know, antes yo era bien cerrada de mente, insisto. Y yo pensaba, no voy a quedarme toda la vida en un trabajo, porque nunca ni lo he pensado. Ya ven, hasta no sé ni qué hacer, o sea, les he dicho. Pero es kind of cool, too, because I would never think that I would be trying so many different things and be like, oh, like, let's try this, let's try this. You learn. But on the podcast, for, the, for example, how did you feel? Oh. Like, this is a, a, like, a good <laughs> thing that came up. Because, mm -hmm. for example, like, we we're, were not social media friendly. Not First camera, all, ni camera friendly at all. Not <laughs> camera friendly. Ni pa' hablar. Nada. Like, <laughs> cero lero. <clears throat> we're like at zero. Mm -hmm. But I remember when that co-worker told us, it was just like, hmm, huh, why not? And we weren't scared. No. No, uh -huh. we were very motivated. Es que así empezó. No te creas. Ah, pero, I don't know. I don't know you guys, but neta, no te emociona. Like, cuando vas a empezar un negocio, estás pensando en algo así. Oh, a mí mi mente me la va. You like, start thinking. Yes. And you're excited it, and happy. It's, it's good when you like have something that you can start doing because, like, you're like, oh, like, what I can do this, that, that, that. Like, 
it gives you options and like te abre la mente like te abre la mente un yeah chingo. it gives you different perspectives you start seeing things without the excuse of oh but what if this oh what if that you know mm-hmm. until later on you find <clears throat> that the business for example the podcast isn't so easy as you thought oh yeah no <laughs> Because we have had our times and yeah. then we're like so down and yes, yeah, estamos like in a tristeza. We're like, we're, do we, we're like, we only got three views. Do we really want to keep on doing this? After, uh, like, we come here after work. Tired. Uh, we're tired. In a hurry. Like, we're not getting that many views. What are we going to do? Mm-hmm. You know what? Honestly, now that you're saying that, like, I was getting unmotivated. I was like, do I really want to keep doing this? But then I remembered you a little bit that. She's like, you can't quit on me. So I was like... Oh, like you came to my mind I was like okay Adelina keep going keep it you keep presentándote and I don't know why but this last episode like ya me dio más para arriba otra vez porque ya no hemos batallado también we have a checklist so now it's easy to edit so ya no hemos tenido problemas gracias a Dios sí versírate y, um, señor gracias um, I don't know like como que tienes tus momentos de motivación y de repente te apago también. Y también, uh, sometimes I feel like, for example, in like mm-hmm. our case, mm-hmm. we see like all these things on social media. It's so easy to see. Like, it's so easy to see everything. Mm-hmm. It's so hard to do. Oh, it's sí. not easy. It's no. so much work that goes into it. And we weren't expecting that. No. We were expecting. Oh, it's easy. And we were like, oh, it's easy. We were easy not peasy. expecting that this podcast would actually turn into an over extra like overwork si sí, es otro trabajo overtime before ah, free overtime and free <laughs> free job I mean it's fun don't get us wrong it is fun it's fun to talk about this kind of stuff and I don't think I haven't seen any podcast here no but again unless I'm wrong but um, it's fun it's something new and we've learned so much mm-hmm. we learned how to edit we learned about cameras about filming like i was telling lupita now that we're trying to like put more content like of what we do in our daily lives it's hard <laughs> like yeah. last time that time that i uploaded i don't know how many a day like ese día que subí un chingo se me olvidaba digo que la gente cuando se levanta ven que sale la alarma no parece que se está grabando no no está pelada yo creo que ponen todo para grabarlo pero está cabrón porque me se te olvida o no sale bien y ahí vas otra vez digo Oh my god, people like really do this like a million times just for this 10 second, 30 second or whatever. Yeah. Like it's not easy. No, it's no, not. It's Props. really hard. And I know people <coughs> dicen, no, es que los, los que hacen ese tipo de trabajos, ah, está fácil, está bien. No, no, no saben. Y, y creo que maybe esto nos ha hecho también valorarlos más porque es, es, sí. es un trabajo. Aunque ustedes digan, no, está fácil para ir a hacer el ridículo whatever you guys want to call it um, es fácil no es fácil y luego además de todo eso la gente que te comenta cosas negativas mm-hmm. estar viendo todo eso oyendo todo eso <coughs> hay gente que está he estado viendo también chicos que se deprimen cuando se hacen viral yeah I'm like that I'm, sometimes I, I want to be viral but then I'm like I'm really thinking about it and I get to I really want to go viral I don't think I, I, I mean I kind of do it and I kind of don't am I ready no creo. Por eso yo siento que quizás no nos, ha, no nos está preparando. He's getting us ready. Yeah. But, um, like you said, it's really fun. <clears throat> like, it's a process that we really enjoy. Mm-hmm. But <clears throat> we had to break up our fear of learning something new. Mm-hmm. Coming out of the shadow. Mm-hmm. Being criticized by our own family members. Being um, when you first start, you want to grow. So how are you gonna grow? We were we were so excited. We we're like, oh, our Look family is gonna go and follow us. It turned out not that many followers. <laughs> no, no, no. We were like, oh, they're gonna share us. It turned out not that many of them share us. My mom is gonna flick. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> my mom and my aunt. We do and have, my daughter. We do have uh, very so loyal much. ones. Oh, see. Sí. Yes, <laughs> they're very very loyal, mm-hmm. but. Like we came to all those faces, like all those like different stages, like they opened up and I was like, oh, like, oh, we're really doing this on our own. Mm-hmm. And sometimes like we would get excited when we would get one view, two views, three views, four views. 30. Like, ah. Now we get excited <coughs> for a hundred. Bye, 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 bye. Yeah. So we're like, okay, like we have to be doing something right. If not, people wouldn't see. Mm-hmm. 
but breaking the fear of putting yourself out there mm -hmm. to be criticized by everyone when everyone has an opinion mm -hmm. to say and they just say it. See, sí. and it's tough. You know what? Oh, I saw another podcast where I mean, like people were like just saying what they really thought. Mm. And do you think people are getting more comfortable with saying what we think? And not caring what people think. <laughs> like, I do feel that people just say what they have. Because if you go on, for example, if you go with a couple of friends and you tell them, hey, how does this uh, shoe look? Mm -hmm. They're all of them are going to have an opinion in regards to that shoe. It doesn't matter if they like it or not. They're all going to talk about it. Mm -hmm. But then <clears throat> that's where you have to like break your fear of like, okay, I'm asking you for feedback. But mm -hmm. if they tell you, oh, is that don't fail but it's not constructive <laughs> you know what i mean and then that's when you have to be like okay i can take yours because you're not being constructive criticism for me so sure okay you reminded me of something too Bye. you know what you reminded me of <clears throat> I, again i was seeing another podcast but it was other people that were getting interviewed and they were saying that that You don't, you know when it's not a true friend because they're not honest. You say, it's better to just be honest and just say whatever you think than be like, oh, si te bonito y lo vas a un lado. And they're like, oh, God, like, what happened to you? And it's like, you lied. <laughs> yeah, because it's not the same as que alguien te diga, oh, like, that shoe's not pretty. Like, mm -hmm. it's not pretty. It's different if a person tells you, you know what? That shoe looks like it lacks support right here, like, on your ankle. <laughs> te hablo with that, but... Like, That's something she would say because she's very critical. Or like you could you tell analyze like, hey, it. if I'm gonna wear this shoe, like, look, mm -hmm. the shoe ties, they're too little. Like, mm -hmm. look, ni me las puedo abrochar. You know what I mean? Then that's constructive criticism. Mm -hmm. Te están diciendo what doesn't work on it. Yeah, it has a good thing, but they're telling you this doesn't work. Mm -hmm. That's really that's different. Yeah. You know, then just tell me, oh, oh no. That shoe is ugly. Mm -hmm. That is very, very mm -hmm. true. It's crazy. Yeah, it is. That reminded me of that. But yeah, guys, it's something else. It is. Anything else? It, but is there anything else you want to add? I don't think so. I think we cut kind of out of topic. <laughs> we did cut <clears throat> kind of out of topic. But I feel now as coming from parents that They had fear to start at their own businesses and run their own things. Now we are like breaking that fear. cycle. Like, no, like, I want to try it. I mm -hmm. want to see. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. That's fine. I'll go ahead and try something else. You know what? You're right. Because I see like all these, again, influencers and stuff. And they're buying like their parents like get trucks, get a house, get all kinds of stuff. It's so cute to watch that too. I always cry when I see that type of stuff. I yeah. wish, like I, no, I really wish, wish we could help our parents that in that much. way. Like, uh -huh. Help them and give them something of so much they have given us, you know? Mm -hmm. Give them that support. Yeah. Right now we still can't, <laughs> but hopefully one but day. in the future, one God, God we'll will help to. us. Yes. But that is really true. So don't be scared. You can do this. You can start that business if you want to. Don't be scared. Like, quítense ese miedo. Like, quítense esa palabra como dicen del vocabulario. No lo digan. <laughs> You're yeah. not scared. You can do it. Because I think a lot of people just, I don't know. I mean, I know we're humans. We're going to get scared. We're all scared of something. Like, I've heard, like, the three top things that a human is scared of is loud noises, heights, and falling. Heights. Me. All three. <laughs> I'm yeah. like, hi. And so I was thinking now that you talk about falling, when you go on a zip line, you have to let yourself go. And that's hard. Because you're in a safe place and now you're going to some that isn't so safe. See, sí, it's because I'm telling you, we need to go skydive or something so we can. Yeah. yeah. Like, it's true, like, the I'm importance of breaking, you your, <laughs> breaking your fear. No, you know, I was actually looking into it. <laughs> I know, when I saw this influencer, I was really? like, oh. It's kind of expensive, but we should try it. I'm down. I'm like, it's not Just that bad. Just wait for money. Is it like 300? 600? Well, I didn't um, search on the prices, but I was like, looking at her I know there's one video. here. I was like, oh, this is cool. Like, this is like... Oh, like you're gonna like after this like if you do this like you can do anything yeah because sometimes the fear it's not what other people tell you the fear is in your head mm -hmm. 
you're like, oh no, I can't do that. Oh no, I'm not capable of that. Mm -hmm. Oh no, I don't have talent. Like you Te put the fear. It's a block that you have. And you know what, guys? Like, just try to do <clears> stuff <throat> that gets you scared. Like, I don't know, like just things you're scared of, try doing them. Try overcoming your fear. Because, for example, I do think this, like, mm -hmm. if you have, like, a thought on your mind, like, I want to build <coughs> this house. Mm -hmm. This is my dream house. Mm -hmm. I do feel that's God telling you, this is what I want for you. Mm -hmm. And I know you can do it because I deposit everything. All those ideas order, you get. Like, in order for you to do it. But we put our fear. Nos and detiene, if, nos para, nos paraliza. If the thought came... It's because you're able to do that. Mm -hmm. And you're able to do many other things. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've seen that on TikTok too. Como, hey, tú lo has dicho tú. Sí, cuando tienes una idea, like, esa idea no se te apareció ahí nomás porque, ¡Shin! No. no. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe like a side. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, so, no, cosa, some, something that would be cool, it would be like if we could do like, not a bucket list, but at least like some things that you are scared of. And say like, okay, I'm scared of heights. I'm scared of this. I'm scared of that. Okay, what are you <coughs> gonna do to break those fears? Mm -hmm. <coughs> you can like, like public speaking. Mm -hmm. That was one of my fears, but this has helped. Really? Mm -hmm. I see. No puede ni hablar. Especially if it was English. <coughs> oh, you guys should have seen me in college. When I was in college, I had a community. You had to take a communication class. I can take a social. Algo social y communication. And I have to present. You guys should have seen. I don't. I mean. That professor was very nice with me. Me dio un buen grado, pero I did horrible. Like, I knew I did horrible. Like, honestly, like, como yeah, un, so eh, Spanish is my first language. So, English, I feel like I have a big accent, and then I can't express myself the same way as I can in Spanish. I feel like tiene diferente sentido. So, I was talking, like, I was reading stuff, and I, the words would not come out of my mouth. Like, I'm like, I know how to say this. Why the hell can I not say this word? Like, no, no está pasado. Your fear broke Sí, you. me fear, <clears throat> me congeló y no podía hablar y no, no podía decir la palabra. Y dije, pues, qué chingas de no puedes decir esa palabra. You know how to say this word. And I think I'm getting a little better. Like, now I, well, I don't know about my English, but my vocabulary, right? But, like, I can speak. And this has helped. Because, you know what, like, for example, for me, like, I always like to talk, but I wouldn't like to talk, like, in front of a lot of people. And when I graduated high school, I had to do a speech. And I remember my... You know, a lot of people. <laughs> but she was, like, my mentor, mm -hmm. that social worker. And mm -hmm. she would tell me, when you're going to go and you're going to speak, you're going to look and you're going to get a focal point. Mm -hmm. And you're going to look that way. Mm -hmm. And you're going to speak like normal. And I was like, okay. So I was like, oh, okay. So I got my focal point. And I was like, la, 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 la. Talking like no one. <clears throat> and then after that, I watch a movie. Mm -hmm. And she is, what is it? Made in Manhattan, something like that. Oh, sí, sí, She's sí. Jennifer Lopez. Uh -huh. She's a maid in New York. The movie. Oh, la película. And you know how the guy, yeah, um, he, he tells the Jennifer Lopez son in that movie, like, mm -hmm. when I go talk in public, because he was a politician, I always use, like, a paper clip, and I have it in my hand, mm -hmm. and it's just, like, a folder, like, I, I just have it there. I was like, oh. So, whenever I would go sell things, uh, like, I would remember, is like, siempre me llevaba algo, like, to have on my hand. I'll be like, hmm, yeah. <laughs> There are so good comforters, you have no idea. You're gonna be missing this one. You're gonna forget it. Hey, Lupita. I tell her yeah. she should have been a CEO. Neta, Lupita, like, I, I can see you, how you're dressing, how you talk, and she's like, not scared to say anything. She would be a good, like, CEO, like, uh, presentando, like, a business or something, and be like, no, this is what no. we have to do. <laughs> Denied. <laughs> this is what you need to change so Careful. it can work. Neta, I see you as that. You're like, <laughs> perfect for that. Um, what was I going to tell you? Oh, I was going to say something else too. Wait. Ah, ya se me fue la onda. Espérenme, ¿qué les iba a decir algo del miedo? Ya se me olvidó. Darn it. It was a good one too. Really? What were you talking about? Well, speaking in public. Mm-hmm. Hablar. Oh, I remember now. What? What people think about you. I mm -hmm. feel like that was a big fear of mine too. Like, I used to be, like, I've always been a good girl. I would never get in trouble. People, like, I mean, <laughs> I'm not. I'm a human like all you. <laughs> and I remember, like, when I got pregnant, for example, people were like, ah, like, like, what? Like, you're pregnant? Like, 
It was a big deal because I was supposedly a good girl. <laughs> Entonces, like that, for example. And now that we got the podcast going, I was like, what are people going to think? But you know what? I don't care no more. I don't know if I'm getting older and maturing. I really don't care. I don't know. Cause and I feel like that was a fear of mine. Yeah. ¿Qué era de decir? Like, I don't know. I, eso sí nunca me pasó. No. No, I was like, oh. Like, I feel like in our culture, like, even our culture, también les importa mucho. Like, ¿y qué dirán? Es que es, I like, feel like us, like, maybe that's another topic. Don't come, <laughs> don't come and crucify me. <laughs> But, like, us as, like, Mexicans, like, we are, like, they're so, like, we're so used to, like, oh, you, like, mira que ya. Oh, you know, cosas así. Mm -hmm. And it's like judgmental, or yeah, like, like judging, like mm -hmm. being on judging people. Mm -hmm. And it's like, no, like we all make mistakes. That's part of being a human. Mm -hmm. We made mistakes. We're not perfect. We learn from our mistakes. And if we want to, like, if, if that person wants to actually <clears throat> improve herself and work on herself based on those mistakes, that talks really good about that person, mm -hmm. you know? Not everyone wants to, like, work on themselves. And I think maybe that's the issue too, that other people look to others, but they don't look within themselves. Yeah. And it's hard, like, it's hard to take criticism. It's just hard to take it from your own, like, family, from your own blood. Like, it's just hard. And I, I feel like from everyone, yeah. <laughs> even at work, when they're telling me something, like, mm, I'm like, mm. like, I'm me, I'm <laughs> I'm just just like, I'm wrong. <clears throat> sometimes I'm like, Well, like, I can't live my life based on what other people say, you know, because mm -hmm. God gave me my life. God gave mm -hmm. them theirs. So, <laughs> like, I'm sorry. Like, I, like we're <laughs> not super always gonna, honest. Like, we're not always going to be on the same page. Yeah. So, I, We I'm can sorry, agree to like, disagree, como yeah. dicen. Like, I'm sorry. Like, yeah. That's what you think? That's on you. That's not on me. Like, if, like, if you're thinking, like, oh, Mirala, she's so crazy. She's over there doing a podcast, trying to be an influencer, la, 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 la. Exposing us. Just kidding. Exposing <laughs> us, putting <laughs> our family drama and all these things. But that's your perspective. Mm -hmm. doesn't have to come to me. It's, it's just yours. And you know what? I know everyone has problems. Everyone. Like, everyone knows that. And I don't know about you guys, but... Uh, no es que sea chismosa que me esté gustando también hoy. Es el problema de otros. Pero no sé, aprendes. Like, it, or you feel... You can relate to it. Maybe you have family that's going through the same thing. Yeah, because, like, I felt like... You know what? That made that, like, really honest. Like, our pa previous work. Like, we mm -hmm. were so united like us four in there like we were so united we had so much trust like we could tell them like exactly Anything. what was going on you know and it wouldn't matter the age difference or the age gaps they were mm -hmm. there to support like like yeah. to give you advice advice, or advice. Mm -hmm. not to tell you it's right or, or it's wrong but to give you advice mm -hmm. you know and That was something we're that never gonna forget i think no. <laughs> where we came from the place never we're <laughs> never. it's already been a year maybe and <laughs> we're <they're> still missing it <laughs> well we miss them like see? we miss them like yeah because the same it's not like it like sometimes you meet people for <clears throat> for a reason like you didn't met those people for no reason mm -hmm. you know i just feel that It, like they gave us the opportunity to be to actually express yourself and what's going on and lose the fear of being judged mm -hmm. or being pointed or mm -hmm. being locked down or being um ¿cómo te decir? Like, oh, menos. Well, yeah or like make like, you feel dumb sí. for example mm -hmm. like oh that was a dumb decision you know if i would have come and told my mom that she would have said like pues que Like, ah. And I feel like even TikTok, I would It's hear that you never say that. But we we had a really good relationship, like, honestly. Yeah, yeah like, honestly, we did. And um, we would bump heads sometimes, too. No, can I not? Yeah. <laughs> But, like, honestly, like, you. ¿Cómo te quiero? Ya se me fue a mi labio también. But, honestly, like, I didn't. Ask. <laughs> <laughs> Let me try to remember. <laughs> like honestly, like they were there for everything. It's good, like we say, we spend more time with our coworkers and our family. Mm -hmm. Like, and they were the ones that pushed us and be like, here, like you have to do this because you have a talent. Like, 
you have something in there like you have to go do it lose that fear mm-hmm. go and we have learned, lost a uh-huh. lot of fears and that was thanks to them yeah that's true yeah. we would have never had this no ever ever <laughs> <laughs> we had our own podcast in that oh uh, yeah in work <laughs> <laughs> we had our own topics. You know, one of the things I think about it too, we always have something to talk about. <laughs> always, all the time. It doesn't matter. Uh-huh. And about. we talk to each other every day. Yes. <laughs> and we still talk on the podcast for another hour. <laughs> yes. It's the warm up before the actual work. <laughs> but that is true. Yeah. So. See, never, so stop with your fear. Go. Enfrenta. Go apply for that job. Go switch your job. Go try something new. Go Start learn business. new things. Start a business. Uh, learn things. Go back to school if you that's your desire. YouTube, TikTok, all those can teach you so many things. Yeah. Um, if you want to start being an influencer, get on social media. Forget about what the friends, the family, everyone's got to say. You only live once. Dijo Sorry, it. it's the truth. Dijo it, that is all I have video. No, this is a TikTok. It's all I have video. <laughs> yeah, I've seen it so many times today. Yeah. Like, it's crazy. But yeah. And go for it. Like, lose your fear. Go. You're only going to live once. You must have been when. You're going to learn. And you're going to become a star. And don't forget to like, follow, share, and subscribe. We'll see you guys. Bye-bye. Oh, wait, you know what? I forgot to mention. Sorry. Yeah. We haven't had anyone to call us. So oh, yeah. again, if you are willing to call and want to talk on our podcast, it's not too hard. We'll make it it's easy for easy. you guys. It's like me and Lupita just conversating. You can say anything you want, anything you think or believe or whatever. Yeah. Don't forget to support <coughs> our um, new segment, Sacando el Fuerzas. Don't forget to call us. And we'll see you on, on the, the next, next one. one. Bye. Bye.